Hi, my name is Elizabeth Stewart and I work with the Foundation of Guelph General Hospital and today we are here to launch the first of a new video series called Yes That Too is funded by you and today I'm joined by Karen Rowland who works with the uh, Guelph General Hospital and maybe you can start by telling us a little bit about yourself, what you do here at Guelph General. Okay, I, my name as mentioned is Karen Rowland, I'm the clinical educator for the medicine program. So I support nurses um, really all across the hospital to stay current and updated with the best practice guidelines for patient care. Wonderful. And um, I see that you are holding um, an item in your hand. This is what we're going to learn about today. So maybe you can tell us a little bit about this. Well, this is our waffle cushion, which helps to redistribute uh, patient weight when they're sitting for any any sorry extended period of time. So patients often will sit up in the chair um, most of the day, really, and um, without having the ability to move around and shift their weight. So this helps to relieve some of that pressure for any extended period of time. It's also great for repositioning. We can reposition patients in the bed with it. We can offload limbs, heels, and arms with it. And it's also very good for our patients with COPD who aren't able to lie flat for um, any period of time, really. So when they're sitting up in bed, it really puts them at risk for developing a pressure injury in the in their bottom. So we can place this right into the bed underneath their bottom and it just helps to reduce that risk of pressure injury. Pressure injury is a never event, which means that nobody comes into the hospital to receive an injury as a result of being hospitalized. So this helps to prevent those occurrences. Wonderful. And um, I hear that you're going to do a little demonstration of how, of how this works. So I'm excited to uh, this is, um, be part of this. Well, first of all, I'll have you sit on the waffle cushion and see how that feels. It's quite comfy. No, yeah. yeah. Elizabeth, you're quite tiny and, you know, able to move around some. But I'm going to put this set of keys on the waffle cushion and have you sit down again and tell me what that feels like. I'm going to sit on the keys. I do. <laughs> have a seat. <laughs> Okay, I feel a little hesitant here. Oh my goodness. Can you find the keys? I can't. <laughs> no, so it does a really great job of redistributing yeah. any weight okay. or, um, yeah, pressure areas. Amazing. I could not feel a thing uh, with the keys there. <laughs> That's great. Um, yeah. So from what I understand is that we had um, about 58 of these that were purchased this year, and then um, uh, the prior year we had a, a number of these purchased. As well, so obviously it's an important item for around the hospital. I love them. They're very inexpensive. Anybody can use them. I even have, not even have, but it's a it's a team approach. So from our unit attendants to our uh, rehab team to nurses, anybody can just grab a cushion and put it onto the chair for the patient for that comfort. My goal is not to. Um, you know, question whether the patient would benefit because they are at risk, but where is their waffle cushion if they're sitting up in the chair? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, um, so these cushions were funded by our donors. Um, so again, I said about uh, 58 this year, as well as a number of them last year. And um, this is just another example of um, a small and simple item, but yet really, really important to patient care. And it would not be possible without the support of our caring and generous donors. So really, um, you help make patient care better at Guelph General Hospital. And in this case, you're helping patients to be more comfortable and you're also helping them keep them safe. So thank you very much. Thank you.